back to a new video. This is a holiday vlog. It's been a long time no abroad vlog. The last one was way back in January. Depends if you count the staycation one as a holiday vlog. But we are on holiday. We've just got here today. We're in Corfu and this hotel so far looks amazing. We literally got here about four hours ago and I'm not gonna lie to you, we had food, had a little walk around, and then we had a nap because we had a really early morning flight. And you know how it is, we were up packing late last night, so we literally had like two hours sleep. So we just thought, let's just have a sleep, and then we can start properly tomorrow, but we're about to go for dinner. So I thought, whilst it's looking nice and tidy here still, let's, is that really bright in my face? What a loud mirror. Let's do a room tour before, you know, the usual. We mess it up. It's really nice. I like the vibes here. My kind of aesthetic. Here is the bathroom. I've stayed in a hotel that has sinks like this before in Milos. So it's definitely like a Greek island. Well, it's not, but I have stayed coincidentally on a Greek island with this kind of stone sink. I absolutely love it. It's got lime wash kind of vibes in the rooms. Also, this is Ocean's First Holiday, which is really exciting. She's excited, you'll hear, hear her squealing in a second. Front door here, we're staying in the Dreams Hotel, by the way. Also got our new travel buggy from Jules, which is the Air. And so far, we are absolutely loving it. It's so lightweight, so easy to put up, put down, and it can go in the overhead compartment on the plane. Love these doors, because it looks like a wardrobe. I'm obsessed. Wardrobe. Loads of wardrobe space. Again, same doors as the bathroom. We're just in like the standard room. There was loads of different rooms. There's rooms down the front that are like villas. And then there's ones on the waterfront. But we thought we're not going to spend too much time in the room. I mean, saying that, probably the most out of all the holidays we've been on to live, maybe. But here is the main part of the room. Here's the bed. Ocean on our bed. That is not your bed, hon, by the way. Don't get used to it. Here they are. Are you giggling? Ocean. Yeah. See your first holiday. Woo! We love these lights as well, but this is the kind of walls that we have in the lounge at home. I love lime wash. And then TV, mini fridge, coffee. Here's the view back here. And then this is what we really, really, really like. This kind of separation door. So it's an extension of the main bedroom, obviously, but you can separate it and make it closed off and make it feel like another room. And then it has kind of a little lounge vibe. And this is where we napped. I napped on there with Ocean and then Cass napped on there. Wasn't it comfy? Yeah, actually, I think it's a sofa bit. But... Oh, really? But they're nice deep sofas either way and they're really comfy. And then we requested a cot for Bobby, and we'll probably drag that out there, but hello gorgeous, are you excited for your first holiday? Can I have a smile? Do Can I have sorry. a smile? No? <laughs> okay. And then just the little balcony. Here Here's the balcony, and it's just gorgeous. Nice views everywhere. You can see the water through there. I'll give you a little bit more of a tour tomorrow, but even though I've never been, it's giving me like Como vibes where over the other side of the water, there's all like hills with beautiful big houses in. And then over here is the amenities kind of thing, like some of the restaurants, etc. Pools down this way, up this way. It seems like a really nice big resort. We're literally gonna spend the rest of the evening going and eating and then probably just going back to bed to be honest. Might go for a little walk, but Time is ticking on, we're two hours ahead, so we'll probably have a little burst of energy because we've had a nap, but I'll probably check in with you tomorrow, and welcome back to my channel, hope you enjoy this video, thumbs up if you do, and I hope you enjoy, let's go and enjoy Ocean's First Holiday. Yeah, I am on my way up. I won't slow down I'm strolling down the street with all of my favorite songs on repeat. I'm dancing through. Hey. 
everything's about to come my way And I don't care if you spill coffee on me Or if the sky is grey or blue No, I don't care cause I am on my way Good morning! Day one, first full day I've just come and put it up at one of the pools The first day is a bit funny isn't it because You don't know your bearings, you don't know where you want to be situated so we're just going to try it at the big pole and obviously we're in England time zone at the moment so we've woke up nice and early and it's really quiet around the pole at the moment. I'm loving the chocolate aesthetic, really enjoy these towels and we've sat near the grass because the grass area is really shaded and we've also bought this little pop-up tent which I've not even looked at yet, I'm going to look at it in a sec because it's like one of them tents with a shade over the top because I'm thinking if we put a towel in there that's where Ocean can kind of lay if it's too bright and hot we just had some breakfast and now Cass has gone to the gym and I'm letting Ocean have her first nap of the day God, she looks so big at the moment I went out for the day on Sunday so today is Wednesday I went to British summertime festival with Primark and that's my first full day away from her and when I got home not to sound like that mum but I honestly walked through the door and I was like oh, she's got bigger but I do feel like she's at that age where she just looks like every second she's grown in front of my eyes she's three months next week I actually can't believe it like it is so true what they say your pregnancy goes so slow but when they're here it's like can't complain though, I'm loving every second of her getting older. Not older, but each milestone. She's so much more aware and knowing and like giggly. And it's exciting just seeing her little personality come out. But anyways, so far this hotel is seeming like a dream. Pardon the pun, because this place is called Dreams. And yeah, it's definitely my kind of vibe. Morning. I'll keep you posted if it's a recommendation. We actually put this through like EasyJet, just done like a package holiday. Cass's sister Kelsey, she was just like, I book all my holidays on there because there's no hidden costs. It sounds like an ad, it's not an ad. But you know when there's nothing more annoying when you're like, oh my God, that's a really good deal for a holiday. And then you get to the end and by the time you've added your flights, your bags, it's like a grand more than it was in the first place. So on EasyJet, literally the price we could see was the final price which was good and it seemed like a really good deal but I know we're still here in term time obviously kids haven't broke up from school yet which is quite funny because there's quite a lot of like older couples here and they all keep looking at me when I'm a few bit which walk past and they're like what is she doing obviously it's I feel like nowadays you see quite a lot of people with a camera vlogging like maybe younger couples I like not that bothered by but older couples. They look at me like I'm holding a pet monkey, honestly. Are you ready to go swimming? For the first time on holiday. So this is a um, 50, I can't remember the thing. I think it's UVP, UPV. But this basically will protect her in the sun. Obviously her legs are out, but they'll be under the water. And then we've got this little sun hat. But I did mention this in my pack with me video. I actually didn't realize that you had to put them in something that was sun protected as well it might sound really silly but obviously you can buy baby swimsuits but they don't all have the factor 50 protection so yeah this one's just from amazon Cass's mum got this for us i'm gonna put this cute little hat on okay swimming up and i won't stop i won't slow down standing on my feet i'm gonna rise up no i won't stop it is my time this is what i mean when i said it's like lake como vibes i know like i said never been there but this is what i envision i mean lake como is probably a lot more like grand but was it grand grand depends if you're english to tell you <laughs> so far so good with taking a baby away because to be honest she just has a little kick about on the sunbed we play with her for a little while and then 
She just sleeps, doesn't she sleep a lot? Mm. And now we're just having a little sit down, taking in the view. I used to sleep quite a lot though. With a couple. What? I used to sleep quite a lot. As in, as an adult? Yeah. <laughs> what do you mean? Right, till about a year ago, I used to sleep all the time. I used to have a daytime nap all the time. Okay, but I'm saying have a holiday with a baby. Right. I'm, lot, yeah. I'm talking about holidays with a baby. Are you a baby? Cass is coming through with Instagram content. If you've not noticed, he only posts on Instagram when he's on holiday. So he looks like he lives this really lavish lifestyle. <laughs> why, is it, why is someone going to want to see me go to work every day? No, 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 of course not. But I'm just saying, like, if you did, if someone stumbled across you, they'd be like, whoa. He's a millionaire. What's this guy doing? <laughs> but really, little do they know. I'm slaving away every day. Yes. It's a hard life. I did actually mention in my last video that you're working a lot at the moment. So well done. When? Congrats. What video? It's not up yet. <laughs> Do a toast each. My toast is <sighs> to Ocean's first holiday. To Ocean's first holiday. I'll copy mine. Okay, well, okay, sorry. But right, so that's yours, so yeah. Book, that's yours, yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to think of one. To um to being a to making a gorgeous baby. <laughs> we did. That's so late. She's eleven weeks old. And is that first holidays? So I'm really appreciate it. Outfit again? We did just do a TikTok outfit, that's why you just gave me that look. We'll start with you, Grumpy Chops. Got a very cute dress from, I can't even say Sainsbury's, but it's Primark, which has little oranges on it. It has little matching knickers underneath as well. And then Cass thought we'd go for the orange as well. Baby man, I'll do it for you. I know you don't like to. Go on. Where's my focus? Oh yeah. And obviously I've had to go for cream because like I said, I didn't get the orange memo. I won't slow down Good morning, another beautiful day. We are at the beach today and I've decided to blow up this little paddle and pull that I bought away. <laughs> Is that funny? I can't show you Ocean right now because she's naked, naked, naked. She literally just loves being free, don't you? Letting the wind hit everything. Obviously the benefits of being at the pool. There's sections of the swimming pool that are in the shade. But I don't want to have to keep putting on the long sleeve, long legged um, swimsuits because I just feel like they're really hot. So I'm going to fill this up and I am winging it. I bought a little pump, cast up the gym again because it's the morning, it's first thing, but I thought I might as well start pumping this up. And then we can put like a tiny bit of water in, literally like not even deep enough when she's laying down to like touch her ears, just so she can lay and fill the water and like splash about. This might go horribly wrong and it might be a fail, but I feel like it's a good idea. What do you think? You think it's a good idea? <laughs> Goodness me, I look wild. That is the only thing about bangs. When you start them, they look nice. When you don't, it looks like you just have a really awful, freakishly short bob. <laughs> I've literally barely vlogged today. It's half five. What have we been doing? She rolls. She tries to roll the whole way over, but she can't roll the whole way over. So she gets stuck on her side, but She's more than happy to just be stuck on her side like that. And I'm obviously here with her. I'm going to do a little bit of editing on my laptop now. And then we've decided we might actually go into Corfu Town tonight. Which, in some ways, you might be like, is it a little bit of a waste? Because we're here in an all-inclusive hotel. And obviously, if we go out, we'll probably go out for dinner. But also we want to see what's around and people have recommended to go into the town. Some people said to me they recommend Corfu Old Town. I don't know if there's a difference. We need to look it up. But we know we're not that far from it. We feel like we should go quite early on in the holiday because if we enjoy it, we have time to go back instead of just leaving it till really late in the holiday. If you have a newborn slash, obviously she's not a newborn anymore, but I'd say around this age now, I can't think what age, I guess before they start crawling, I'd just take them away. I know people were like, 
it won't be a holiday anymore. So many people said to me, like, you will not be able to sunbathe when you're away. We literally are having so much time to ourselves because she's sleeping so much. I think it's the sun and just different environment. And when she's awake, she's so nosy. Literally just looking around everywhere. Ah, we can hear you. Sucking your fingers. I wasn't sure if sucking her fingers meant she was teething, but people said it's a comfort thing. I'm getting time to read a book. I'm getting time to do a lot more than at home because obviously at home, when she's sleeping, I'm literally just making the most of tidying up, getting stuff done, working. Obviously, I'm still doing a little bit of work here, but mainly just chilling and enjoying each other's company. And when you're a little bit bigger, you can play more, can't you? Yeah. Yeah, but today we went swimming and it was a bit too late in the day. We needed to just go swimming in the mornings because she was not loving life. Who's getting so good at tummy time? You're so strong now. You're only 11 weeks. Look how strong you are. Give me the keys. What time are we going out? What time now? Half five. Yeah, seven, not five, not six. Ew! Anyways, I'm gonna go get ready and I'll check in with you and show you our outfits when we go out and take you to the town. Yeah, I know what it's like to be broken. And I know what it's like when nothing goes your way. So I'm just gonna let myself. This is our view whilst eating dinner. We're being people watched and we're sitting next to each other. And we've both got ourselves a beer. Same with my hotel, right? Yeah, so cheers. I won't slow down. Cause I am on my way. I won't slow down. Yeah, I am on my way. I won't slow down I am on my way oh, I won't slow down mm. Who's in the best mood in the mornings? You're in the best mood in the mornings You're in the best Say I don't need that dada, I'm too happy <laughs> Yeah, wear them sunglasses should we put them on now? People have been asking me where these sunglasses are from and I don't actually know. They have a B on them. A brand sent me like a little congratulations package and they were in there, but I don't, I'm pretty sure they weren't from the brand. <gasps> Stop it, you. Who's this cool girl? But when we're outside, she actually really likes them obviously because she's squinting and then they are actually polarized sunglasses. So they're beneficial for babies so they don't actually have to squint. And look how cute they are. Another day in paradise. That's one good thing about coming to the Greek islands. I feel like you never ever really see clouds. I actually got an anklet version of this last night. I actually can't see a thing, I need to grab my sunglasses. But I, we went for a little walk just outside the hotel and found an anklet. So that is exactly what I wanted. I'm gonna... <laughs> Did you put them up? She loves the fan. Best babysitter is the fan, isn't it? Man, I always had stories about the city line and the crazy nights. Figure I should probably give it a try. Baby, check it out, see what it's all about. But the traffic was fast and the money was slow The people I met you never get to know I kind of miss this place I used to live back home Cause up here it's pregnant Paycheck, rat race, what's next? I'm tired of feeling like a small fish in a big pond I find the door back where I came from Everybody knows my name my friends are still the same I get the slow life in the girls by Like a bonfire on the door line Oh, you can keep your nine to five 
reality of a nice holiday looking like this. I didn't even realise my head looked like this until I put the camera on. Wild. This girl has just woke up from about a three and a half hour nap. And now it's bowl time and she's looking like she's gonna go back to sleep. Honestly, not following and not that I have a routine, but I'm trying to work to wake windows a little bit more. I get asked this quite a lot. And I know her age at the moment, she should be awake for no longer than 90 minutes at a time. Which sounds crazy. When I first heard that, I was like, what? But if you actually like notice when it gets that 90 minute mark, she starts getting really ratty. So they actually are ready for sleep if you follow the weight windows. Are you watching me talk about you? Yeah, your hair looks wild. Wild! I will talk at some point about what we've used on holiday and what has been worth it, not worth it, because I'm getting DMs about it as well. And like hacks to keep them cool keep them calm etc but well, you're loving your first holiday aren't you my well-behaved bubby where's that camera where's that camera you're living the life of leisure aren't you aren't you mm -hmm. currently got a wet muslin on her too which is a godsend for keeping them cold hello need to see ya I definitely jinxed it yesterday <laughs> Come to Greece if you don't want to see any clouds. We just had a downpour. It was mad. Everyone run for cover. To be fair, it was a bit like a tropical storm. It literally lasted about 20 minutes and now it's starting to come out. But yeah, take everything I say very lightly because you absolutely might see rain. But it looks so nice now. I just, I'm not getting Greek vibes here. I don't know if it's just where we're staying, but I'm really getting like lagoon like i said like lake como that kind of just like the water looks green which i'm here for do you know what i mean very tropical far 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 away not greece at all vibes that's what i'm getting and i'm loving it to be honest if you have a baby and you want to baby wear them with carriers take it from me the failure put them in it a lot i put her in it when i first got the carriers oh god i would have no idea when like under four weeks and she was fine don't get me wrong cried a little bit but as soon as she was on me and i walked around fall asleep now now she's more aware it just doesn't like i've not tried this holiday yet but she's in a really good mood right now and i could be ruining that but i'm going to try and put her in because this art poppy carrier a it was expensive and b i just think it's convenient to have her on us at some point so let's see how this goes baby you wanna come into my little kangaroo pouch yeah you can be mummy's pouch <gasps> yay have you had a good day you're not gonna remember it are you <laughs> yeah you could love it now because you're bigger are you bigger Remember last time? And you screamed. And you screamed, but now you can hold your head up. It's so fun. How fun is this? So much fun. Yeah. We can we can cuddle together all the time. You're gonna love it. You're gonna love it. it. Might take a little bit of getting used to again. Because like I said, she's very aware now my almost 12 week old can't believe it so yeah the moral of the story put them in it a lot because if you don't then um yeah they'll just end up hating it because they're not used to it but if you do it all the time then obviously they know no different can we wait to show daddy when he gets out of the shower he's gonna be so shocked because last time you went on it on him you screamed you remember Trying to save your time In case you're thinking about Breaking out the bucket list Girl, you can skip this Funny business Cause up there it's complicated And overrated Down here Do you want to show me?
Show them the back of your top. It's cute, isn't it? Ready? <gasps> it says, meet me at the ocean. Oh, don't pull my necklace. She's at the grabbing stage. She's starting to grab everything. Us, my necklace's hair. But that is the end of the holiday vlog. We are literally about to go to breakfast. We're just packing up the rest of the room. And then we've got a car picking us up in about an hour. So we've got a nice amount of time. And that is the end of Ocean's first holiday. How was it, baby? Oh, she's put doing thumbs up with her toes. <laughs> How was your holiday, Dada? Very good. Very good. We had a lovely time. I highly recommend this hotel. It's called Dreams Corfu. I think it's a chain of hotels, but this one in particular has just been renovated. It's stunning, really, really nice. I had a lot of questions about it. And I don't know what this vlog's gonna end up like. It might just end up being really choppy, but I still like to do these because it's memories for us to look back on. And one day this little girl will have all home videos on the internet. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed and I will see you in my next one. Say bye bye. Say bye. I love you all.